Emma Raducanu has ended her season, and pulled out of next month's Billie Jean King Cup in Glasgow, because of a right wrist injury. The former U.S. Open champion has been suffering from the injury for a couple of months. The world number 76, who has started working with Andy Murray's former fitness coach Jez Green, now plans to return to action at an exhibition event in Abu Dhabi in December before heading to the Australian Open. Radhikanu said, It's disappointing to get the news from the doctors that I won't be ready in time, particularly with it being on home soil. I tried to do everything possible to get it ready in time, since my last tournament I've been working every day on physical training and rehab. I've got confidence in my teammates and look forward to playing next year. Quote. Radhikanu is also looking for her fifth new coach in 16 months after Russian Dmitry Tursunov ended their working relationship earlier this month. The former world number 20 has already teamed up with Olympic champion Belinda Bencic. Tursanov said, we didn't agree on the terms and there were some red flags that just couldn't be ignored. Meanwhile, Radhikanu has come in third on the list of highest paid female athletes for 2022 despite a year of mixed results. The 19-year-old became an overnight superstar when she won the U.S. Open as a qualifier in 2021 but has not been able to pick up a title since though still found herself pocketing more money than world number one Iga Swiatek, who won eight titles this year alone. Helped mostly by her endorsements, Radhikanu came in third behind fellow players Naomi Osaka and Serena Williams in Sportico's list of highest-earning female athletes with a total take-home of £22,690,117, $26,200,000. Just £2.77 million, $3.2 million, of this has been from prize money, with the British number one's best result coming in the semi-finals of the recent career open. Thank you.